If you ever watch my Canva tutorials, you will know that I usually bang on so long about lots of random stuff because I want to teach you all about design and principles and making sure that your graphics are actually good even though you're using Canva. But today, I'm literally just going to teach you one thing. This is something that I teach my students on the regular because this is the best way to share links. So say for example, you've got a friend who's like, oh, can I have that Canva design you created? Or you've got a team member that said, can I edit that design you've created? Or you've got a graphic designer and they say, can I edit this design you've created? You're like, yes, but how do I send you that design? Do I have to make you a team member? No, that costs money. We don't, we don't need to be wasting money in our lives, in our businesses. So the way that you can share a design with someone is as follows. So if you want to share your Canva design, this is how you do it. Go up to the right hand top corner and press the share button. Simple start, press share, then don't go down here to all this section to download or to brand template or public view link or template link. None of those. Don't even press see more and see all of the really great options that are here. None of them. Go back to the main section. We want to have this collaboration link. Now do not just press copy link. That big purple button, we're not ready for it yet. You need to press this little drop down menu and change only you can access to anyone with the link can access. Don't just change it to your team. If you've got a team, if you're sharing it outside your team, anyone with the link can access. Then making sure it says can edit. If it's not already, you can have can view or can comment. Don't do any of those. It's pointless if you're showing it to someone to edit. Leave it can edit and press copy link. This link here will then open up this exact design when you paste it into your thing and then someone can go in and edit it as well. This is so, 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 so useful. Now, what I want to mention too is that you can share a template link. That's really great. I'm going to show you how to do that now. This is a template link if you want to share this design, but you don't want anyone else to be able to edit it. You want them to be able to make their own copy separately in their account, not related to all, at all to your design. If you want to do that, then you can press share and you can select not brand template because that saves it to your own personal brand template. But you want to share this template link. So if I click template link, it's going to generate for that mean that for me now when I press create template link, I'm going to copy that. Now I want to share with you a couple of different nuances around this. Firstly, if you edit this original design, it will be reflected when someone in someone new clicks on that template link. It won't update someone. If someone's already clicked on the template link, it won't edit their old version of the design. But if anyone new clicks on that link and makes a new copy, your, your, your reflected changes in the original document will be reflected in that template. But I'm going to show you what happens when I press, when I share this link. So I'm just, I've just entered in the template link here and you'll see for me, that you've got this edit template option. This is because I'm currently logged into this design. If I was logged out of this design, this would appear very differently for me. It would just say, I think we'd just say use template for this design. And so if you're wanting, if, if you're trying to test out this template, you're like, why does they edit design? Well, I don't want to edit the template. They're going to go in and edit my design. That's only because you are logged in with your account and Canva realizes that this is actually your template. So if you want to share a template with someone, you want to share that link. Don't worry, no one can make changes to that unless they're inside your account. So those are the two main ways I recommend sharing links is pressing the share to link button inside share and that collaboration link, that's the one you want to share with people if you want them to edit your actual design. Hope that was helpful. If you want more Canva and design tips, make sure you hit subscribe, make sure you hit like if you liked this one. And if you ever want any more support, you know where to find me. All the details in the description. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye.